Chapter 11 Public Places A public place is a social place that is open to all and is visited by people very often irrespective of gender, race, age, caste, religion and class. The main public places and their uses are 1. School School is a place where children go to study. We learn to play games, share things in the school. We also learn good manners in the school. 2. Parks and playgrounds Neighbourhoods have parks where children play on swings, slides and seesaws. Adults and elders come to the park for a walk or to just sit and enjoy. Many parks have water fountains in them. 3. Library A place where there are plenty of books, magazines and newspapers to read is called a library. We can read these books, magazines and newspapers either free or at a nominal fee. 4. Post Office A post office is a place where letters are received, sorted and delivered. We can also buy stamps, inland letters, postcards and envelopes from the post office. Letters written to us by our friends and relatives are posted in a letterbox. The postman delivers them to us according to the address given on the envelope. We can also save money in the post office savings account. Money orders can be sent and telephone bills can be paid at the post office. 5. Weekly Bazaar or the Marketplace A bazaar is held once in a week in the villages. It is known as the Weekly Bazaar. In cities, the place from where we buy our daily requirements is called a marketplace. A marketplace has many shops. Six, dispensary or hospitals. In dispensaries and hospitals, the doctors examine the patients and prescribe medicines for them to get well soon. The nurse takes care of the sick people. If the patient is serious, then he or she is admitted to the hospital where X-ray, blood test and surgery, etc. are done if necessary. 7. Temples or Religious Places Religious places like the temples, churches, masjids are all known as places of worship. We go to these places to worship and pray according to our religion. 8. Cinema Hall we go to the cinema hall and see movies of our choice on the big screen. 9. Theater Plays, dramas, musical programs are conducted on a big stage in theaters. Magic shows are also performed in theaters. 10. Banks we can keep our money, jewellery and important documents safe in the bank. 
Whenever we require the money, we can withdraw it from the bank. We can also deposit money in our savings account in the bank. We can withdraw money from the ATM which is open 24 hours. 11. Places of interest Forts or palaces Forts and palaces are places of historical interest. By visiting these places, we are able to get a lot of information about our past. 12. Museum All kinds of ancient and primitive articles are kept in a museum. With the help of these articles, we can know about the people who lived in the earlier centuries and what they did. 13. Buses or ST Stand Buses take us from one place to another. Buses also go to distant places. Fourteen, railway station. The trains stop at the railway station. There are different kinds of trains like electric trains or steam engines. The trains which travel very long distances move on a high speed. Porters are there to carry our luggage. 15. Fire Station The neighbourhoods have a fire station. It has red fire engine. The people working in the fire station helps to put out the fire quickly. 16. Police Station The police protects us and our house from the thieves. Some of the policemen control traffic on the road. They are known as the traffic policemen. These public places are meant for our convenience and enjoyment. It is our prior responsibility to take care of these places. A. Whenever we visit these places, we have to make sure that we do not spit and throw garbage in these places. B. The places like libraries, museums and hospitals are the places where silence needs to be maintained. C. Whenever tickets need to be purchased for these places, we should always buy the tickets because the money received from these tickets helps in maintaining these monuments. D. We should not write anything on the walls of the monuments. E. If anyone tries to spoil the public property, it is our duty to stop them from doing so. Everyone in our society has an equal right to visit any of the public places. We can live a comfortable life because of these public places. Hence, proper care should be taken to maintain these public places. Now, let us do some exercises. 1. Which public places would you visit for the following purposes? A. To buy groceries. Market. B. To keep money safe. Bank. C. To read books, magazines and newspapers. Library. D. To play on the slide. Parks. 
E. To send a letter to your grandmother. Post office. 2. Match the following in column A with column B. 1. Library. Reading of books. 2. Banks. Deposit money. 3. Post office. Post letter. 4. Hospital. Sick people. 5. Temples. Worship and pray.